Hi guys, I'm going to be reading from my blog today. Um, it's my old WordPress blog because I have not been on this blog in a long time. Um, if you guys know about my website, I have stopped, well, for the time being, then I'd start writing my WordPress blog because I was trying to recreate a blog on my website, through my website, but I'm not sure if I'm going to go back. I'll see. I'm not sure if I'll go back to WordPress or not. We'll see, but either way, most of you guys don't know about my WordPress, or you don't remember about it, so I'm just going to read a post that I made in 2017. On that blog post, it's called, I fell for an older woman, for an older woman, which is a true story. It really did happen. Now, I wrote this post on December 4th, 2017 you can find it on my wordpress blog and yeah <clears throat> so i'm going to read it aloud just for the hell of it <sighs> okay i fell for an older woman once this summer in fact by older i mean she was 11 years older than me yikes this was an absolute first and it completely shocked me even though i know that i'm the type of that i'm the type that severely craves intelligence and wisdom Saviosexual. That's me all the way. She was gorgeous. She sure didn't look her age at all. For having nine kids, most of them grown, she looked fucking amazing. She'd been with women before and enjoyed it. Although she was married for nine years and mostly unhappy, I always found myself feeling sorry for her, even though her man had tons of money. I always thought that was the reason she didn't want to leave him, despite his constant verbal and emotional abuse. We'd had a really good friendship for a few months. I mean, really good. She was in my state hours away, but we made plans to meet together one day. I had the hugest crush on her. I just thought she was totally fucking amazing. Stay home mom. Always worked out. Sweet, motherly, and sexy as hell. She was very open to talking about sex with me, and I loved it. This one was on my mind every day, every hour. We flirted a lot. My hubby was really hoping that somehow on the great by and by that we'd meet and things would go smoothly. But well, sad to say, religion strikes again. She was heavily into religion. This new wave of Hebrew nonsense talking against Christianity as if it's any more heresy than that stuff. Religion is a religion. It's all toxic in my eyes. To me, that was the only major flaw she'd had from what I could see from just talking to her online. I normally don't even reject people if they're into religion because my philosophy is, well, when you do your thing, just don't throw that shit on me and we're good. However, she apparently hadn't gotten that memo. So, about four to five months, our friendship, so after about four to five months, our friendship died out. We got into an argument or two about religion, as people, and as people always do, they try to force their beliefs on me, and I'm having no part of that. I tried to be understanding with her, but she just kept informing me that she wished I would follow her in her beliefs. She even tried to show me pictures of what she claimed to see years ago that made her turn her life over to Christ, as if saying she saw God or some image of him. In my mind, I was like, well, that's nice, but uh, I don't see it and I don't care. Sorry, not sorry. I really hate that that friendship was lost. I really miss her sometimes. We had a shitload in common with one another, despite our age difference. This shit's always happening to me because everyone within the Bi Bible belt has gone cuckoo for that Bible. I can't. As much as I really wanted her emotionally and sexually, I had to let her go. I was hurt for weeks because I'm not dealing with judgmental people. Not by a long shot. If people don't want to live and let live, well, they're going to miss out on a lot of decent people and opportunities. And with that, that's the end of the blog post that I made. That is a true story. Um, yeah, it's kind of sad, but it's true. It happened. Um, this woman I'm talking about, you know, I came back into contact with her. At some point last year, we tried to repair our friendship, but even that didn't last very long. Um, so I just let her go for good now. This time it wasn't religious based, it was something else we were fighting over. There was something else we didn't agree on. But, you know, I just let her go. I, I had to let her go, but that was the time I fell for an older woman. She was literally, like I said, 11 years older than me, and you wouldn't believe she was 11 years older. She definitely did not look at she up here herself so well. After having nine kids, you wouldn't believe it. So, yeah, that's the story, y'all. <laughs> I just wanted to read that aloud for the hell of it. And, um, I hope you guys really enjoyed it. If you want to see more of my old blog posts, you should go to 
my WordPress, one hell of a hippie dot WordPress dot com. I'm sure it's in the description box somewhere. If you want to go read some of those, I might come back and read another one aloud if you guys prefer hearing it. Um, let me know what you think about these stories. I have a bunch of little things I could, you know, possibly make videos out of, new topics, stuff like that. Just let me know if you enjoyed this. So, um, yeah. Have you guys ever fallen for anyone way older than you? Let me know your experience in the comments below so we can talk about it. And I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are having a great second month, hour, minute, day, and month. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Peace out.